today with another video this one is going to be brought to you by the company love me hair but before i get started on all the details if you are new to my channel welcome my name is sherelle if you like what you see towards the end of the video please make sure to hit the subscribe button down below and if you are subscribed to my channel please make sure to turn those notifications on so you don't miss out on any of my videos and this is brought to you by the company love me hair it has been a while since i reviewed a unit from them that is what their packaging looks like this is what it looks like on the inside this is the unit and as you can see there's an edge brush attached to it with the theme a purple comb a purple bag to place your unit in once you're done an edge band of course purple included this hd wig cap and it just has some company information reward program yada 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 because i know y'all want to hear about this wig Ooh. Am I not gonna have to go in and curl anything? Okay, so this is what it's looking like so far. Seven by six HD closure wig. This is a loose body weight texture. That parting space, look how big this parting space area is. It already comes pre-bleached, so you're not gonna have to go in and do anything. It comes with two combs on the side, breathable cap. Like on. Um, as far as the fit goes, I feel like it is just a little bit too big back here. I do like that this doesn't have any ear tabs because it was very easy for me to kind of like tuck this behind my ear. And this is laying down really nice and flat. Now for extra security, I personally would go in because I do have a small head and place some bobby pins on the side. I also would probably rock a wig grip. Um, so that I don't have to worry about it slipping and sliding. Yes, I am noticing some room back here in this area. Also what the hairline is looking like, so you're not gonna have to go in and do any plucking. Look at that parting space. That looks really good. Yes, you can move your parting space around if you choose to. Oh, I really don't wanna mess up these curls, but okay, there's the parting. Wham, bam. I can already tell this is going to be a super easy install. The curls are already done. All I'm gonna have to worry about is cutting off the lace. This lace area is pretty big, which I like because it's giving like the frontal look without having to commit to a frontal. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this lace off and I'm not sure if I'm going to use some mousse or if I'm going to use the lace putty that I just recently um, purchased because I don't think I'm going to have to do a lot. I don't think a lot needs to be done to this hairline, so I just want this to be quick and easy.
me any time to install this unit. They do have this label as their ready to go wig and they were not playing around. It's definitely beginner friendly, ready to go, ready to wear. The only thing you have to do is cut your lace off and fluff out the curls. Based on this, it's really nice and thin so I didn't have any issues with getting that to lay down. Once I cut the lace off, I was already impressed but I did go in with my lace putty, just a very thin layer and that was to help kind of lay it down and give me some more security. And then on the side, I did have to go in with some bobby pins because this is slightly too big on my head, especially in the nape area. If you do have a small head, be sure to check the website to see if they offer a smaller cap. So I use a little bit of lighter powder in this area. They did bleach the knots. It was just coming off a little bit red in certain areas. So the lighter powder helped it to blend in more and also match my skin tone. I didn't have to go in with any powder in the parting space area. It's already nice and open. It's giving scalp. They did a really good job of bleaching the knots. Go in with some serum because I am noticing some frizziness and some flyaways. Like if I turn to the side, you'll notice a few shorter hairs popping up. And then also you'll see some frizziness from me fluffing out the hair. Notice a little bit of snags going on towards the nape area and also towards the ends. See on this, I feel like it's nice. It doesn't feel heavy on my head. But of course, with this hair curled up like this, I feel like it's looking a little bit more fluffier. When you wash the hair, I do think it's going to give off a more natural everyday type of look. In this area right here, even though I can't see any tracks when I turn around, I do wish they would have added just a little bit more hair. Not too much, but just a little bit. And it is definitely beginner friendly, but if you are not a beginner, it's great for you also because I don't want to always have to worry about bleaching knots, plucking the hairline. At this point, the companies are giving it to you just ready, just ready. So you shouldn't even have to purchase wigs that you have to do too much work to. Like who wanna do all that? Well, you have so many options. Don't you guys think about this one? And if you've purchased any ready to go wigs or ready to wear wigs from the company, let me know down below. If you are interested in this one, I am gonna make sure to leave all the links down below in the description area. Guys, do not forget to subscribe to my channel, turn those notifications on, share and like this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.